Dark Elf. Hello, yeah. everyone. Welcome to Failing Forward. Ooh, that's not supposed to happen. Um, we are a D&D stream presented by Tabletop Tavern. And uh, the Tabletop Tavern are a club based in Kent, England, that hosts online and offline D&D games on Saturdays and Mondays from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. GMT. We welcome all players of all levels, experience, uh, of all levels of players, sorry. So not like a level 20, but like experience, exper anyway. Um, from newbies, fresh race newbies to uh, veterans. So if you would like to join a community with better DMs and regu regular game nights, visit our website on www.tabletoptavern.club. And I think somebody is going to put the link in the chat. So now to the stream, I'm Maz, your lovely game master tonight, and I would like to introduce our players. Sorry, I would like the players to introduce themselves. So first of all, let's start with... I got this wrong last week, didn't I? Let's start with... Let's start with Toby. Let's just start with Toby. Why not? Hello, I'm Toby. I'll be playing Venus, the half of Bard, who uh, currently with us. <coughs> his sister has caught a bit of a bug after eating pork. That they have eaten. And let's go to Day. <laughs> Jay? Jay? Oh, you, said yeah. Faye. you said Faye. I'm like, who the hell's <laughs> who's Faye? You feel close. <laughs> His name is closer. <laughs> I, thought, I, I thought she said Bay. Right. I'm like, let's go to Bay. I'm Jay. I'm not Faye. And I will be playing. Boris the Dwarf, Arcana Cleric. I'm looking f quite forward to see how the rest of this scenario turns out. And I will remember what my name is. Okay, great. And then we're going to Biscuit. Hi, I'm Biscuit. That's me. I will be playing Ham the Tabaxi, which is written just here below me. I am looking forward to the game today. I'm Yay! Good at introductions this morning. <laughs> Right, Brad. Brad. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, dude. Apologies. All right. Hello, I'm I'm Brad, and I will be playing Brad. Brad. I mean, Bren, <laughs> um, the high elf. And um, um, let's just see what happens today uh, in this whole kind of uh, thing that is failing forwards. Anyway, <laughs> so yeah, hopefully nothing bad would happen. <laughs> but yeah. Yeah, well, that sounds like a threat. Hopefully something bad will happen to any of you. And finally, we have Float. Hello, I'm Float, <laughs> and I am playing that guy whose name has just escaped my mind. Uh, a bagra. <laughs> That's the one. It's, like, down there as well. Um, but yes, and he is the only one of the party who apparently does not, like, fall asleep on the job. And then has to wake everyone up, so... Hopefully that doesn't happen again. Because next time he will just be leaving. He'll be like... <laughs> Screw like the party. shit, I'm out. Uh, <laughs> I dare you. I inspired um... you. <laughs> <laughs> you did, you did. And I think I then used it for something to help someone. I don't... I can't even remember what I used it for. Oh no, I think I used it to stay awake tonight or something. Was that? Yeah, oh. I think... I can't remember. Anyway, I do have You're a recap welcome. though. <laughs> Thank you. <clears throat> so last session the party wandered through the rainforest they found some random tools they picked them up and went on their merry way they were as they arrived at the city they were traveling to they were accosted by a frantic woman Ephibia Burrowthruff Wilkins Cox who thought they were the exterminators sent to deal with a rat problem that the city has and currently they are locked in a dusty tavern where there is indeed a rat problem that they have just dealt with um, and I can't spell, I put down and bite off, no, never mind, and bit off far more than they could chew because even though they killed all the rats and they're whatever it was, the tentacly monster thing, uh, everyone bar Galbraf, Balgraf got knocked out and Bren had a horrible nightmare and most of the party is still diseased, I think. Yes. In fact, I think only, I think only Bren's not diseased. Balgraf isn't diseased. Balgraf isn't diseased. No, I, as far as I'm neither, aware, I, neither is Boris. No, Only Boris. Ham and beans. Ham and beans ate the ham. 
that they shouldn't have eaten. They are definitely diseased. Yep. And Boris took was able to take it with his yes. strong dwarf. Bren oh, is diseased. So we have Bren, Bren, ham, and beans are all diseased. Yes. Everyone's taking damage. Everyone's a bit migrainey and headachey and ouchy. Definitely. So what Sounds like a do? good night at the tavern. Yeah. yeah, tentacle monsters. What would you guys like to do? Okay, so we're not on con. We've all been woken up now. Mm-hmm. Okay. So have we exterminated the rats properly? Uh, you can do an investigate if you want to. Yes. I'm in the right I'm in the I'd like to investigate to make sure that we've killed all the rats. What are you doing? I said they're dead. <laughs> Well, yes, but they could also not be dead. Oh, they're all dead. Oh, we did. You are, in fact, the rat-killing expert. Yeah, I'm never wrong. Yes, yes. Ham is the expert on rats. Yes, I am. Yes. <laughs> so, shall we go get paid? Can... Um, <sighs> did she tell us how to get out the door after we were done? Don't we? She did lock you her in. locking us in. Indeed. <laughs> Yeah. Can't we just un- unlock it from the inside? Can't be too Did you difficult get a key? to unlock. No, you know, one of those shifty fellows. You know, possibly one of you two. You what? Probably open a locked door. Um. Ooh. Well, I I don't uh, I don't actually know if I can open a locked door. I don't really have the tools uh, for it, or the you know, or am I ever kind of good in it? But you know, maybe, maybe somewhere that there, there, there might be a, a, you know, like a key or something. Maybe. What I, is, I, oh, that's not a color that you can see. Ooh, a bit of red. Look at that brown. Yeah. Look at that I red. can see a door appearing. Yes. A very wide door. It's ten foot wide. Yeah. Beautiful drawing skills. Behold. Well, look at that door. <laughs> Do you reckon you can open it? Yes. Okay. Um, and I'll come up behind, uh, so, come up behind you oh, and offer you advice on how to pick it and tap um, you on the shoulder with a bit of guidance. I see you're giving me a lift and uh, Ham will, will crawl up his jacket <laughs> to just reach the handle on the door. So, uh, when she twists the handle, does the door open? Uh, well, no, it does. But, it, you know, uh, deadlocks... That's how you've been locked in. There's like a huge oh. bar of some kind blocking or a, a piece of wood or something, basically locking the door from the outside. Oh, God. I, I can tell you, the door is fine. Does this hacienda <laughs> not have any windows? Yeah, but they've been boarded up. Okay. Conveniently, but you know. Might be easier to, to remove those bars. I just want to say that you do have two giant gaping holes in the form of trap doors. Excuse me? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. I mean, uh, we we could have went down into those pits and just like uh, went out the other way. Ah. Don't don't forget there is that acidy, gooey, <coughs> gross stuff. sewage, gross, so gross stuff, stuff down in those uh, holes. Just, can you twenty, please? Me? Yes. Yeah, you. Uh, yeah, you. So what have you done? Eight. Okay. Uh, okay. You're going to feel the entire hacienda, hacienda shake and shudder as um, it feels like a storm uh, suddenly just sweeps past and rattles the boards and the door as well. And just as soon as it started, it disappears. It's a bit like the weather we're having right now. Oh, <laughs> that, that was peculiar. It's kind of like it, it was um. snowing in April. Very odd. <laughs> Oh, please, can I not be the only person in this world who absolutely despises snow with a passion? I hate it so much. And having I love it, snow. It, 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 it makes snap. everything look this good, gets rid of all the rubbish. Oh, yeah. my gosh. I have a it really good friend it. who loves snow as well, and I, we just don't understand each other. Oh. But anyway. Oh, oh, and I'm going to turn around suddenly in the direction it blew towards. When you and turn then around, look. Uh, Ham is still clinging on to you, and she just like, sort of drops off. <laughs> uh, <yeah. laughs> <laughs> it's going I'm going to draw where it's the the wind was to and from it went this way. Uh, are you okay, Ham? Ooh. No. 
If you'd that like, is... you can climb up on my shoulders and sit on top. That's too high. I'm scared of heights. <laughs> I'm quite sure. I can assure you it's not that high. <laughs> too high. Well, whatever that was, I think the, this whole kind of place is pretty much unstable to actually take a wind thing. I'm going to go take a closer look at why the wind blew over here. And I'll walk through and sort of have a look around, lick my finger, see if I can still feel the direction of the wind. It's, it, this, it, as soon as it started, it, it literally was a 15 second thing and then it finished. Very peculiar. Something very odd's going on here. Yeah. Beans is uh, going to remove the, um, the gopies of his, his bagpipes from his throat. <laughs> I was gonna, I was gonna, you still had them stuck down there. Uh, and whilst everyone else is occupied with the door and the draft, he is uh, he's scrambling over the the counter to uh, make himself familiar with this this chest. He's going to try and and get into what treasures might be inside. Okay, uh, it's do, not locked. Do we perceive this scramble over the? I mean, is he being is he subtle about it? Is is he trying to be like shh? I'm not 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 really going over to steal stuff. And is there like a before he took it out of his throat? Was there like a whistle every time he breathed? It would be uh, <laughs> that could <laughs> draw yeah. him in that direction. Squeezy, squeezy uh, sounds. So let's he was. see. Fifteen stealth. That means nobody notices this except for Boris. Huh? Boris is going to notice him scrambling over. I will turn. Just have a look. Why are you scrambling over there? We're trying to get out of here. Is there is there a way out over there? Why are you over there? Is there a way out over there? Well, there was a wind came through and I was just having a look around. Have you there found anything? There was also wind over here. Oh, there's wind over there. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the most collaborative party ever. Um, do, you, uh, do you need any help over there? You seem to be... He's a halfling. How would I see him over the over the counter? <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. So, uh, uh, beans, are you um, opening the chest? Yeah, in full view of Boris. Okay. So it's <laughs> Jumping it's full up. of it's full of <laughs> bottles. I've got a periscope. Um, I don't know if that's just come up for you. Yep. Everyone. Oh, okay. It has. What? It's called Golden Scarab. It looks like a very fancy import beer. Uh, each bottle holds a pint, and there are twenty bottles. Twenty green bottles. Then one. No, there's not. They're not green. <laughs> they're, they're, there's like a really fancy kind of label. Is anyone else seeing a ring, not a bottle? Yeah, the yeah, ring yeah, is the logo. Yeah. Sorry, I, oh, I couldn't. Okay. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> he's, gonna, like... uh, he's gonna put, uh, let's say, three of them in his own bag, and then uh, he's gonna going to wave his little hand over the counter. Everyone, I have found something to drink. Yum. Uh, to, to drink? Um, I uh, I mean, isn't there many things to drink in here? Because it's just, this is a restaurant, isn't it? I mean, All right, you don't get any then. Um, <laughs> oh. Oh, okay then. <laughs> it's just... Oh, poor Bren. Okay, so is no one else responding? Is you don't have to. It's just... no one seems interested. Uh, uh, Beans oh, is just gonna look at pocket. this door. <laughs> yes, I wouldn't mind wetting my whistle with a little drink. I'm. Uh, I guess would would this be like a very fancy looking bottle? Uh, bottle like maybe too fancy for this establishment. Um. Not, not really. No, this looks like a, a very expensive bottle, but also. Yeah. So I was, I was thinking when you walk into like some any old any old kind of tavern, you wouldn't really find like the most posh looking thing. Mm, you just find some old swill. No. But this wasn't a special strength. crate. That, this wasn't a special. Crate. He's gonna try and and just, just drag the crate out of the open so everyone can have a look. What do you have right. there? It's a crate. It is full of drink, as I have said. 
Brad, why don't you come here and check it out? Uh, uh, um, um, okay, I, I will check it out. Um, so, uh, what, what's the what's what's the importance of this? Um, these drinks? Um, I I, um, I I don't actually get drinks really. I'm too young. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, you're going to hear a really loud knock on the door, and it's going to shake. Sorry, that was probably super annoying. Oh, God. <laughs> who, is, who is that? Hello, who's there? Hello? Hello, it's Ophelia. Open the door. Wait, wait, wait a moment. Uh, are, are the rats dead? Yes. Yes. Yeah, um, <laughs> yes, yeah. <laughs> yes, they are. So. Oh, oh, goody. Has anyone been bitten? I think I... No. Uh, what? Perception, please. <laughs> Perception? Perception. You're oh. lying. Uh, just, um... Shall I do deception as well? I think. A, B, C, D. No, you do it with disadvantage because you started to say yes. Uh, okay. This, uh... <laughs> I, I didn't. I just like straight up no. <laughs> she believes you. Oh, dear. Oh, 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 dear. If with a minus three. <laughs> I'm oh, God. so impressed. <laughs> Um, okay, she's going to say, "Oh, are you sure you've not been bitten?" Uh, I'm, I'm, uh, yeah, yeah, yes, I'm, I'm sure I've not, I'm not been bitten. But <laughs> Didn't you hear us the uh, first time? Open oh, the sorry, bloody door! Sorry. I'm so sorry. All right, and then she's going to, um, she's going to open the door, and uh, you're going to see Ephibia and her fake blonde hair, and there's going to be four <laughs> guards behind hair. her. With big thick bales of um, vegetation that are dry, that's dried out. So not just hay, but like all sorts, you know, vines and all sorts of things. And um, they start to place it around the hacienda, and uh, and then you see a few more men and women behind them bringing large barrels of oil or something, oh God. which they're rolling up the um, stairs. Um, so I was just going like to step stand. out the door to the side and be like, um, yeah. I'll, uh... Get out of your way. Um, wonderful, wonderful. So none of you have been bitten. Is that right? That, that's correct. Oh, oh, I'm so relieved. I, I really didn't want to have to trap you in there and burn the whole place down. Um, right. So I, I, I have your, um, I have your things, uh, your money. So well done for, uh, for, for getting rid of the problem for us. Um, um, Jose, Jose, come along now. And you're going to see this big burly Goliath who's going to be carrying a box that looks like a tiny little toy box in his hands, but it's actually a, a substantial chest. And um, Phoebe is going to say, <clears throat> so I, uh, I have a few things from the mayor um, who would like you all to have some items as a, as a, as a thank you. So here you are um well let's go inside the hacienda for a minute shall we and so she walks in the goliath smacks his head against the um at the top of the door Whoa. and um and then just dumps the the, the crate in there so Phoebe is opening it up and in there you'll see five pouches which look to be filled with gold coins which look like they are filled with gold coins sorry and uh, can toby roll a d20 please I can, and will. <laughs> a four. Okay, so uh, what's going to happen is everyone's going to feel the ground shake. Uh, Phoebe is going to look a bit scared, and then you're going to hear a screech coming from somewhere. Oh, that's not pleasant. Uh, if you do a nature check, I, you oh. can tell I can tell you where that screech came from precisely. Oh. What's that? No. <laughs> it came oh, wait, from I... somewhere, says Balgraf. Did you... Okay, the screech came, came from out there. From the east. I believe the screech came from the east. I believe it came from the south. <laughs> I, I, I believe it came to wait a screech. <laughs> you didn't even hear. <laughs> it came from 
The east, obviously. How do you not know that? Do you, do you the... know your... Well, the wind's in the east, you know, the anyway. north, east, south, and west, the difference between them? Yeah, I know my... Do, 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 yes, do, I was do, using do. Ham's map earlier. It told me Actually, exactly which way was north. is it on your map? See if it's been updated. Uh, should we get the, the log, the map log? Uh, <laughs> it says the yeah, X is that way. <laughs> okay. Okay. So how about we go in the actual direction of the noise and then go back to your log later? My but log why? doesn't say we uh, should go that way. Yeah. Uh, excuse me. So. Oh, Phoebe's going to uh, try to interrupt you, but you don't you can ignore her. But but the um the, the items would you like me to Oh yes, please. Oh yes, yeah, okay. Yeah, All right. right, so uh the pretty the pretty poisoners. Um Mr Sparkles, the mayor would like you to That's have this lovely uh beak beak polish for your Beak. Nothing sparkles. Beak. Um, beak polish for your beak. Yes, I have a beak. <laughs> <laughs> um, and I'm going to link the D20. Uh, the beyond the thingy. There's your. Oh yes, there's your. Blast. Oil flask. Oil. Oink. Yes, yoink. And uh, <laughs> she's going to continue. Uh, and um, which one of you is little Bobby? That would be me. Yeah, ah, Bobby. little Bobby. Uh, um. Right, well, um, Mr. The Mayor sends you this lovely chain mail for your use, and she's going to ask the Goliath to pick it up because it's too heavy for her because it weighs like 55 kilos. And you're going to see immediately that it's made for a person his size, not your size. I was only joking. So you're not, you're not little Bobby. He no. is little Bobby. He is little no. Bobby. He's just he's a little. littler. <laughs> Mr. No. Little Sparkles, oh. how about I give it to you and you can give it to Mr. Uh, to little Bobby when he's ready, yes? I cannot All right. this. Wonderful, wonderful. <laughs> uh, and which one is Dave? That's that, Dave. That's that your pun to bread. <laughs> she's uh, she's uh, pun to bread. Okay. Yeah. Oh, oh, lovely. Dave, um, for uh, you, there's this wonderful cloak. Um, oh, okay. here it is. There's a oh. cloak for you, and she's going to hand you a beautiful purple cloak. Cloak, not cloak. <laughs> oh, With a uh, golden trim. It's oh. gorgeous. It's so gorgeous. Oh. Well, it looks, uh, yeah, it's beautiful. looks divine. Have, have, uh, uh, thank you. Um, yes. You already have a cloak. Trade with me. <laughs> Forget oh. Pete. Which, which one is Pete? Cloak? She's going to stare at the I two dwarves. What? The what? I'm looking for Baguette Pete. That's definitely that one. You should point to Boris. Boris, okay. <laughs> She's going to pick up a uh, burlap sack. Did you sack. say Baguette? Yes. Baguette Pete. Uh, oh. Baguette, well, that's about anyway. Do you happen to have a Baguette? <laughs> uh, no, I, I have um, this for you. Uh, can uh, Biscuit roll a d20, please? Of course I can. When I remember how to. One more, I can do this. What? It is what? done. What does Bella it's mean? Done. Shake. Twelve. Shake. Shake, shake, shake. Bella. Okay. Um, you're going to momentarily lapse into unconsciousness, but you're going to stay standing. Your eyes are going to glaze over, and you are going to see the universe wow. in all its glory. Like you, you literally see the Big Bang of this universe, of that universe, of the universe that that you guys are playing in. You know that. The sound cats make when they see birds. That chirping sound. Yeah. It's like chirping. That one. Is everything okay there? I think she's chirping because there might be a little. I. I. There's nothing up there. Um, you're going to be given, Boris, this. The burlap sack is going to contain a wonderful leg of cured ham. Oh, mm -hmm. ham. Oh, oh, this is fantastic. The, you the have... did say you're going to love it. So um, you, and she's going to turn to uh, Balgraf. Bread. Uh, uh, no. Yeah. She's, what? Even a roll, a bread roll. I, I, well, or a baguette. Perhaps, no. Um, what am I oh. going to eat this with? Mm. She's going to look so scared. Like, um, would I, I, I'm not sure. I was just given the ham to give to you by the mayor. Okay, I'll pick up this great big bit of ham. It weighs twenty-two pounds. The ham weighs struggle. 110 pounds, by the way. Uh, um, Strength six. I'm not going to um... live that. 
<laughs> you can always try. That looks like one tasty bit of ham. Anyway, she's going to turn to Balgraf and she's going to say, um, so you must be a dovetail. Mayor Squigglepaw wow. says you don't like presents. And he sends you his very warmest regards. Um, and instead, he knows you will appreciate that. In, yes? Uh, but he said you would appreciate this letter. And she's going to hand you, Balgraf, a letter. Can I open said letter and attempt to read it? Yes. Yeah, I can't read the handwriting. It... <laughs> oh, no, read the... Uh, it's uh, like, go down. down. Go down. Yeah, I knew it was there. But no, no, I can't read the handwriting. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fair enough. Are you going to read it out for everybody, or are you going to... Uh, I, I, I like can read name. it out for everybody. Uh, my yes, dear Victor. Dovetail, it has been far too long now since our last meeting. I do so look forward to sharing a drink and one of our long chats, you so prize. Thank you again for your great generosity in helping our small city. I know your troop of exterminators is busy dealing with much tougher vermin than a few stray rats, and for far more coin. It is much appreciated. Your loyal friend, Mayor Bolly Squigglepaw. P.S. I do recall you promised me a bottle of golden scarab on your return to Millennial. I hope you have it with you. Very nice. Have we lost Jay? Uh, uh, yes, his I camera... I pressed the button I shouldn't have done. It seems to have disappeared momentarily. Hello? Uh, no, can Balgraf roll a d20, please? He can once he stops typing. Uh, Nine. Nine. All right. Nine. So as you finish reading the letter and you're looking around like, ooh, so I'm Dovetail now, huh? Um, so I'm that guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Phoebe is going to let out a screech because immediately as you fold the letter back up again, the earth is going to shake and not just a little tiny, oh, I'm having a bit of a tremor one, but like a full on earthquake is going to start happening. The bottles are rattling. Oh. Uh, even the Goliath is having trouble uh, standing and you're all going to need to make a deck safe so that you can stay standing. At I the end hold of this. the meat oh. close. I'll hold on. To the, I'll hold. I'll go. I'll get under this table just in case. Um, so uh, dex safe. Should I roll with disadvantage? Why are you rolling with disadvantage? Am I in a trance? Oh no, you you snapped out of it. Oh. It was like it was it was like fifteen oh. seconds. By the time Balgraf finishes reading the letter, you're okay. Oh jeez. Ah. All right, Boris. On the other ah. hand, Ooh. ah indeed. Oh, that ham, <laughs> Sam. Oh, that ham. That ham, man. <laughs> All right. That ham is luck like, throwing you, man. <laughs> No, I must protect. I will. I want to fall back. So I land on my back, but protect the ham. You're gonna land straight <laughs> on the ham. No. Oh. And the ham's gonna count as a one d six. Bludgeoning ham damage. Bludgeoning damage. So can you roll a one d six? Some hard ham. Not the ham. Not the ham. That's a lot. That's many. So you've taken five damage as you fall over on top of the ham, and the ham somehow attacks you. <laughs> um, okay, but uh, you know it, it only lasts about a minute and a half, and you, uh, Ophelia, falls over dramatically because that's what she does on top of the Goliath, who uh, saves her from falling. Um, on purpose. On purpose. Yeah. <laughs> She's like, oh, oh, it was so oh I fell over on purpose. I fell over on you. <laughs> Right, so um, she's going to uh, get up again and, and look all scared and frightened, and uh, and then she's going to say, and um, your coin? Oh, and she's going to look around, like, bewildered. Um, I, yeah, I'm, 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 I'm really walk up and say, oh, oh, it's I'll take okay. the coin for the... the I was just going to say, while people were flailing about, Beans would have made an effort to reach out to grab those coins. <laughs> all of them. But <laughs> <Yes. laughs> like oh. everyone's just going for the coins. Yeah. <laughs> does this does this place get um, earthquake smudge? Um, well, well, of recent, of late, yes. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, all right. Um, does does um, I'm gonna look uh, look up at the clouds. Do, do they look like it's like? Are you outside? I'm I'm going to 
take a step outside, look up at the clouds to see if it's like a storm. Maybe we're in in the eye of the storm war. No, it it's it's completely beautiful upside. What? There, there, there was... a cloud in sight. So there was this big wind and there was this earthquake. Um. Mm, that, I'm going to get up on my feet. That is much strange. Uh, okay. Brush okay. off the ham. Which now has a large amount of your own blood from your nose on it. <laughs> on the burlap sack. Uh, it's I still delicious. To... I'm going to... Yeah, ham is watching. <laughs> <laughs> Hamception. <laughs> Hamception. That was not pleasant at all. <clears throat> it was really quite awful. Um, I... you, have you got another one? I think I've ruined this ham. It's okay. <laughs> I'll accept the ruined one as well. I, I, I'm afraid I don't. The mayor isn't really available right now. What about chicken? Play... Chicken? Chicken. Make a chicken. Oh, yeah. Chicken. <laughs> uh, uh, pepperoni. What's pepperoni? What happened to all the coins? <laughs> yes. Okay. Right. Can I just point out 150, pa- 150 coins, gold coins is going to be quite heavy. So okay. uh, I would just like. He's standing there. He's he's not even standing. He's just sat on the floor. All of his his pouches are filled to the brim. And he okay. Move. <laughs> he, he got uh, the coins then, did he? He got the. Co- he's got all the coins. Yeah. You're, You're whatever, jingle he, when you walk. His pockets currently are filled with the with the twenty bottles, not the coins. Oh. Okay. <laughs> He's got the the you are over encumbered thing that you know is on Skyrim. Yeah. <laughs> he, he is trying to reach out for the coins, but because of the weight of the bottle, he's like he slowly can't. reaching out. Uh, must uh, grab more. So, but Balgraf was closest. I feel like he would have got there first. Just all right. 100%. Uh, he he can't move. So <laughs> the chain mail um, and would the bottle. Go... Ham seeing beans reaching out would go to ha- would go to beans and uh, well, thought... try and. Try and slowly push him forward. I thought Ham had the armor. He's gonna say. <laughs> Thank you, sister. She's yeah. So... Helping. <laughs> he seems to be a little bit slow for a bit. Is there any way uh, we can help him along? To make uh, himself lighter. Uh, what what was the woman's pull, name again? Uh, I can't remember. Ephibia. Ephibia. I have to uh, look up uh, her name because. Ephibia Borothroth Wilkins Cox. Ah, uh, Ephibia, um, would your Goliath companion be able to take a, a few of those bottles uh, to give to the mayor on, on my behalf? He, he reminded I me of an old pardon? debt that I owed him. Oh, um, well, uh, yes, of course. Uh, when well, he went, he's currently on an expedition, but I suppose I could leave them in his office and then maybe if I don't tell hmm maybe if i don't tell his butler that he's got the bottles in his office it is fine we will go and put the bottles into this rich man's office ourselves (laughs) that Um, sounds like a good idea idea. well uh, dovetail he does seem to have a special friendship with you so um i'm sure i can trust you (laughs) yes of course so of we're course. also delivery people now yes. and rat killers. Yes. Oh, just um, just we my are day. Men of many skills. Uh, well, the pretty poisoners do have a very strong reputation in these parts. So, um, why don't I show you where his office is? Why don't ah, you? Yes, thank you. That would be uh, brilliant. Oh, about that gold though, before we move on, it, it seems quite heavy for you there. Are, are you sure you're all right carrying it? Yes. Who's Belgraf talking to? Sorry. Ophelia, I thought she still had it. You haven't said who's been given the gold no, the, yet. No, the you? gold is in the chest. It's for us. Five pouches. It's for you. Oh, oh nice. Um, Five pouches in the chest. Five okay, pouches cool. of gold in the chest, along I... with the Goliath armor, the uh, flask of oil, the letter. Oh, it's all in the chest, is it? Okay. Yeah, okay. okay. The so, Goliath was the chest in there. So how much, how, much, how much gold do we get, get each? Um, it's 150 each. 150. 150. And that's yeah. if we share it. No, no, that's yeah. Yeah. We'll be fair this there. time. I mean, Ephibia, like, you you know, do you really trust her to actually know how to count, to be fair? Nope. So can, maybe can you should just my money? in yeah. front of her. <laughs> no, oh, I this is really nice. 
Yes. Um, uh, would it be investigation to count the money? It would be intelligence. Can you count? Just straight intelligence. Just straight up intelligence. Like, as we know, I failed that role in real life so hard. So... Oh. I Beans is like... very happy because he's got double according to his <laughs> counting of the coins. Uh... <laughs> Can we eat these? <laughs> no, they're not chocolate coins. Look... How do you know? Sure. Right. Okay, all right. Okay, okay. Ham is going to start counting and get like something's going to distract her, and and she'll be like, "Where was I? Oh, one, two, three. And then you never get to the end anyway, and you're like, "Yeah, I'm sure this." Um, Balgraf and Bren are going to do the same, but you will manage to just about get to the right number. Oh, yep. One, two. Is this one? No, two, three, four. No. Oh, yeah, there we go. Just, She's just there, nervously wringing her hands, watching you count. Um, Beans, um, you, didn't, you just think you can guess the weight. You, you think, <laughs> yeah, you think there's 200 gold in there. And uh, and Balgraf, uh, no, sorry, not Balgraf, Boris, Boris, you're going to count quickly. And by the time you finish, um, you actually got a couple of extra gold in there. She over, she overpaid you, but you're not going to say I'm fantastic at counting coins. Whenever you have to buy sandwiches, gold. it's always good to know the exact amount of change in your pocket. Exactly. Um, uh, uh, while you you are all faffing around doing this, um, you're going to hear the uh, um, these things here. Let's get to the right layer. Oops, layer. That's, that's wrong. We are so dead. <laughs> Has none of the uh, the people moving in and out, by the way, mentioned the tentacle monster on the ground that's dead? Well, they can't see it because they're it's not the ground, going. Isn't it? Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's, oh, yeah. it's, it's, it's in the bottom layer. Um, it's under the trap door. So it, they've uh, they've closed the trap doors, and uh, the lead Bernie person, I suppose, is uh, going to stare at all of you, and, and he's and he's going to say, um, "We're we're all done here. So if you just want to shift on out, set the place on fire." Okay. Uh, You're going uh, to burn the whole thing. I, I, are you sure that would? pretty much clean the establishment why um mm. would you like some help um, what, oh, what? yeah uh, all right well, what, what kind of help stuff we need to, well, you need to create fire i i'm pretty good at creating are you, fire wait what, are you what, sure you don't want to get outside first what uh, happens to yes. what's happened to the real owner of the establishment did they get eaten alive by these things oh no um they got bitten by a rat and then they got very sick and died it was oh awful. ah yes that's that's a terrible shame um, and then, yeah, okay. unfortunately, he bit his um, daughter and his wife and his oh. auntie and his grandmother, and then they all died. Wait, so you're saying that's right. basically like um, this this person got bitten and then they bitten the other people? Yes, that's exactly what I'm saying. Oh, okay. But uh. you didn't get bitten, so you're all right. Otherwise, I'd say you really ought to get some medical attention very um, soon. I'm, I'm fine. Um, yes. Um, yes. Um, Can you do a deception roll, please? While he's in that, I'm just going to ask her. So, um, if you're just going to burn the establishment now anyway, um, why did you have to employ us to exterminate the rats? <laughs> you got a four, and you got a four. You still failed it. He has a good point. <laughs> sorry, uh, sorry. Um, oh. let's, let's go to Biograph, and then we'll... Uh, Deal with the failure that just happened in the in the uh, screen there. But what did you ask? So uh, what I was just asking her why she had to hire us for the extermination if they were just going to burn down the place afterwards anyway. <laughs> Is that what well, achieved because, the same goal? Well, because unfortunately, uh, if we burn wetlands, they don't burn very well. So we had to make sure they were dead first. And also, uh, the pretty poisoners do have a very good reputation, and this is this is nothing to you all. And of course, that's why you were being paid so well and handsomely. So we knew you'd get the job done. Hmm. Uh, it I just, just look at my letter again. Like, um, who hasn't done a D twenty roll, by the way? <laughs> Pardon? Who hasn't done a D twenty roll? D twenty. Oh, is it Brent? Uh, Brent, you're the only one who hasn't rolled D twenty. Can you roll D twenty? I rolled it. You said roll oh, deception. Okay. I rolled three. I, I oh, know. Yes. We, oh, we'll deal with that in guy. a second. You need to roll a D twenty now. All right. D twenty roll of doom. Ah. Uh, Giants. Uh... <laughs> right. Um, okay. Everyone's going to hear a thunderclap, 
a huge oh. black cloud's going to appear across the entire skyline and ah. it's going to deluge with rain. It's going oh. to be so thick and so fast oh. that the people who are trying to set this thing on fire are like, for crying out loud, what is this weather about? And um, <laughs> they're going to all start huffing and puffing in anger. And uh, Ephibia is looking up nervously. And then as soon as everyone starts to kind of get kind of, you know, cover and go back into the Hacienda to or whatever to try and stay out of the rain, it's going to go completely sunny and beautiful once more. Oh, what? Huh? Hmm? The, 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 what, what? What? What is this place? Why? I mean, that, it, that was a freak weather. A freak weather. I mean, I can't see any clouds for like what miles, and it starts to heavy rain for a second. I mean, uh, maybe the clouds are invisible. I'm not sure, really. Actually, our clouds are invisible. There's no visible clouds up there right now. It's gone completely there's, clear. There's the no... whole thing was about three or four minutes. Oh, so, God. so you saw the clouds get dark. You it... heard the thunder. The rain came down. Maybe if. It... And it's... the people complained. They started getting all angsty and put the stuff inside the hacienda. And then, by the time they'd all gone inside, it was it was completely over. Completely okay. Is is that is that normal around these parts anyway? Um, I mean, I don't know these lands. These lands are completely foreign to me, really. Ephibia um, is going to say, we, we do get rain quite often. Rain, and, and the rain clears up and then the clouds are nowhere to be seen. Well, just... no, this is quite unusual. I'm just going to look how, up. How long has it been this unusual? It's probably about a month and a half. As... Anybody new moved in in that time? No. Any but strange you things it, grown? The ma- oh, oh yes, so many odd things are growing. You said something about the mayor just then. Well, yes, I was just about to say that um, I think the mayor may have said that this is why he had to go quickly on an expedition. He doesn't normally do things like this. He lets it to the people he pays. Beans is downing an entire Beans needs to roll a d20. Scare up stealth, by the way. Sorry. <laughs> He's just drinking. He's just drinking. He needs to roll a d20, for sure. Ham will be watching him drink. He offers a bottle to his sister. Uh, ah! Okay. Uh, you're going to start flying. For the rest of the session, you're going to fly. He looks Please. at the bottle. Beans, I can't get it. Come down. <laughs> I am in danger. Help. Uh, oh. Um, he starts grab his, flying grab his over, leg. over the building. I'd like um, Ham to do a perception check. Oh. oh perception? Yes, perception. Okay. Uh, mm, that's too low. I'm sorry. Beans, He's floating in the air. I, I would it's like to take my uh, rope, uh, create a hoop in the end, and begin a lasso to try and hook him. So uh, ha- have him like a kite. Okay, uh, could I guess attack roll? <laughs> I don't know. Yes, attack. Uh, strength or dex? I'll just leave it. Dex is fine. Okay, so we will. I'll shoot. I'll pretend <laughs> it's a crossbow just for that. It'd be easier. All right. He's what trying yeah. to catch, catch the loop, by the way. The weight of those bottles right, doesn't seem to be affecting see. him any longer. Uh, you're going to, yeah, sorry. No, you're going to fail that. Um, but no, now let's go just... back to Ephibia and Bren. Ephibia is oh. going to look at Bren and she's going to say, oh, but what? The, the things on your, your, your trousers are all in tatters. And there's little tiny... Bite marks on your ankles. Yes, you I'm. You weren't in. I, 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 I uh, He's going I, to scream. That was me. Ah! Look, uh, that was uh, you. Ma, um, I, I please, was please, please, please. Um. Okay. Uh, All right. Roll, me. roll deception if you want to. I'm gonna cast uh, bardic inspiration myself. It's floating in the air. Yes, it's it right. was me. Floating, floating in the air. Yeah. Two. Maybe he's got. Maybe he's full of hot air, and that's causing him to rise. 
That's exactly right. <laughs> I do like it. This, this woman is terrible at like figuring out who. Oh gosh, she sucks at her job. Right? She's like, oh, I, I suppose. Um, I can tell right. you why. I have a very good reason. Do you tell me? We are called the pretty oh. poisoners because we are pretty poisoners, and to strengthen ourselves against enemy poisons, I bit him so that he could grow <laughs> more tolerant to <laughs> poisons. Yes, Very yes, surprised. more more tolerant Yuya towards poisons. Yuya is, is going to look completely confused, and she's going to just nod. Oh, I see. Well, that makes complete sense. Um, right. Well, shall we get out so the gentleman can carry on with burning this place down? Why am I uh, flying? Uh, I, I don't know. <laughs> she's got to roll exception now. Um, I don't know why you're flying. <laughs> uh, probably the alcohol, maybe. Perhaps. <laughs> Beans is gonna. I mean, ham. I'm getting me muddled up. <laughs> ham is gonna scale the scale the wall or try and climb up the wall. What would I need to roll? Just a dex check. A dex check. Or athletics or acrobatics. Sorry, athletics or acrobatics. It's like I haven't played the Indian ages. Uh, acrobatics. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, you're like, fine. Scales up the wall and makes a leap for Beans. Just jumps off the roof. <laughs> okay, uh, is that an attack roll? It's a grapple check? I don't know. <laughs> right. Beans, as, as best he could, would try to, to angle himself towards his sister to, uh, to make it easier for her to, to grapple him with her. Sister? <laughs> what would I need to roll? Just to... Um, let's just say <laughs> that you got him, right? Because otherwise we'd be here forever. And, um... <laughs> And is Brad still outside talking to Ophelia? Uh, yes, I'm still outside talking to Ophelia. And you see these clouds rolling over again and the oh. lightning striking. And the deluge happens again, except it's even more intense than before. Oh. And it's it's like being under it's been under a waterfall, that's how much there is. The men who are just coming outside and started lighting things are like, oh the crawling out and um a few oh. looking up and then she's uh, trying to hide, Oh, please help me to the Goliath, the strong burning Goliath who's just so you know, like puts his hand out as an umbrella. Uh, that's and it, it's just pouring and pouring uh. and pouring, like it's oppressively bad rain. Oh, it's not stopping this time. It just continues. It just continues. Okay, uh, I just well, this is pretty peculiar, isn't it? Uh, but maybe it's just uh, okay. So what should we do now? Because maybe we can hold up that armor and use it as an umbrella. We can all get underneath it. It's quite large. It's mail. It's got it's mail. mail. It's chain mail. So all it's, it's gonna do is rust. It's just gonna rust. <laughs> yeah, okay, yes, then. I mean, well, like, yes, we won't do it's that. Just like... <laughs> Why yeah, don't we just... we just go undercover under one of these trees and we'll be able to stay dry under there for a while? Is wow. there, oh, there, there, is, there is there is the hacienda, and maybe we can just step into here and just uh, dry off from um, the rain. Maybe. They're about to light that on fire. Brad, I wouldn't go in there if I was you. How can oh, they no light it? fighting this nonsense on fire because of the bloody weather. Wow, 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 wow. They can't so light the it on fire because it's raining. It's, it's well. Um, well, this doesn't come across. <laughs> Maybe it's been caused by some form of magic. Oh, for God. Do you, you can do Arcana if you want to. I would like to, yes, please. Yes, go for it. Ooh. It's being caused by my shoes. Is it caused by a thing? <laughs> Who knows? We must destroy his shoes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna. I Brent. Brent's gonna try, even though he um, he's not good at what um, what uh, he's going to try to piece together in his mind what it might be. Uh, What's he gonna roll? I just arc on. So okay. He think he he actually thinks it's the shoes. <laughs> Take your shoes off now. But maybe a specific kind of shoe. I'm not a sure. specific kind of shoe. Okay, with that question, we're going to take a break. With that question hanging in the air, we're going to take a break, and uh, we will catch you all in ten minutes. Bye. Thank you. Sorry, uh, I'm going to go and get up.
And we're back. Welcome back, everyone, to the second part of our session two stream. So before we left, we... I can't remember we what died. we did. We did. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't do much, to be outside honest with you. We started flying. We walked okay. outside the building. And it rained. Yes, they've got as far as outside the building. Um, we had people get their loot and their pay for their wonderful job of killing these uh, deadly rats. Uh, is my car? Yeah. Um, it literally happened 10 minutes. Big storm, say to her. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Someone, someone <laughs> was paying attention. <laughs> <laughs> uh, little the building. Lazo said, can't escape the, the building. building. Yes, the, inside the building. Um, Wait, in the, oh. you're, because it's raining. Yeah. It's well, raining some, outside. Some of us are. Some of us stayed outside. There, there's been a bit of an earthquake. There's been a bit of a tremor. There's been a random screech in the air. Beans is floating. Beans is floating in the air. And... Yep. Yes, Ham, Ham is latched on as well um, with with her arms. And uh, and everyone is going to hear the screech once more. Everyone. Oh, oh that's the screech. Coming from the east. Beans is pretty scary. The screech from the east. It will be all right. Let's just watch oh. the other guys deal with it. I think that's a great idea. What can I can Safety I safely from a distance? Can I discern what it is or something like that from that screech? It's a screech. Or is it like um? Is it from no, a... okay? Do a uh, nature check. Okay, I will. Uh, you know, Bren says we kind of you know perk up and just try to focus in on this. Uh, the nature check. Yeah. So what's this screech? I it's had no place. idea. <laughs> <laughs> It's a thing! <laughs> it's coming from that way and you point uh, west. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No, it's no super thing. I can, I can tell you it's a snail. <laughs> snail? I don't oh, think no. it's, it's a snail. It might, might, maybe it's an exotic a bird? Sweet no, no. Snail? A it's peacock? definitely a snail. Do you have don't peacocks here? <laughs> what is it? A Mysterious snail. Wait, hold on a second. <laughs> hold on a second. I, wait, wait, I, need I a am minute. the animal master. I know rats, and I hopefully know whatever this is. Okay, <laughs> animal master, here. what is it? It ain't from around here. It's not a snail. Here. It ain't from around here. Snails don't As make noises. Through the trees. Loud ones do. Through the trees comes crashing oh, a God. giant snail. And you're snail. right. That's so what the hell? Snail stands for screaming. You see? I mean, I, I, wait, you see? And you see? I lied. I I just want to. I I just want to. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, Maz, have we all healed right. healed up? No, no, you have not. <laughs> oh no. No, 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 no. How on earth did you know it was a snail? Are you psychic? That, that is meant to be a snail, by the way. No. Just, okay. Just it's very, a very gummy worm. Is it a snail or a slug? It's, it's, it's definitely a snail. There's a there's a carapace. carapace? A house. Okay. It has a little snail house on its back. Uh, it's about it is, to attack the letter E. It is about the snail. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Can we all say not the letter E? e. <laughs> Bees are gonna fly up. I'm gonna die. E. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's gonna attack the letter E. I'm gonna take that away because it's going to distract you guys, and you're gonna think it means something, and I don't. Want no to one go it. east. We don't know where it is anymore. <laughs> Okay, oh god, it's confused. like um one of those kids kids like um That's exactly what books, it is. but more horrifying. Uh, everyone who is around you, including Ophelia and the Goliath, are gonna start screaming their heads up. Oh. Oh, what is it? I've never seen one of those things. Oh hide and protect me and it's the Goliath hiding behind Ophelia. Um Oh god, what what's screaming do? It's a snail. It's a giant snail. And it's uh it's literally setting everything on fire as it walks past the trees. It's just uh, a bug. Uh, okay, I guess it's... It's, just a bug. it's setting and it's the size of the Goliath. Well, I guess... I guess, I guess That's I, a big Goliath. The slimes... The slimes... Is, is, it's bigger than... Yeah, the, it, no, Goliaths are... Are they medium or are they large? If you it's think medium. about it, I guess it can okay, do no, our jobs large, about it's large, 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 It's about the size of the, the dimensions that I put on the thing, but not on the worm. You're the DM. Make up whatever word you choose. 
I can't the even boy. remember the he's, real words he's that we have in language. He's a big boy. There we go. Yeah. Uh, he's, a, <laughs> he's a big boy. Yes. Look, that Where? thing's appro it's approaching this building, and it's made of wood. We've got to slow it down. And I'm going to okay. shoot a bolt of ice at it. What? Okay. Wasn't the idea to burn this building down anyways? Yeah. Yes, but we're on it. Well, you're in initiative now, But we now, can so... get off but it, can can't fly. we? Oh. oh, we're in initiative. Now Do you need, need to. to wait, 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 hold on, let me clear the initiative. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. <laughs> don't, don't move. Now roll for initiative. Oh, for God's sake, come on. Can we just get off this thing and let the snail do our jobs for us? I mean, you're all going to attack. Remember to click your icon. I, I would like um, our good friend Boris to do uh, the, the first, a full <laughs> first turn, a surprise attack on the. Uh, oh, snail. wow. Oh, our quality initiative. Wow, guys. <laughs> That's horrendous. Uh, you are going to hit it. Okay, so it should slow it down. It's going to take two cold damage. It is going to slow down. In fact, it's going to move very, very slowly indeed. In fact, it's barely going to move at all. Um, and everything around it is going to be on fire. We should have enough time now to get off of this. All right. It's going to slow now. Okay. Oops. Um, yeah, it's going to be uh, <laughs> it's going to be Beans's turn. Beans uh, is going to lower himself to the ground uh, until Ham can find purchase. Are you like swimming? Down yeah, to the he's, he's he's flailing. Yeah. I feel like it's it's kind of a hot air balloon situation because all of the yeah. the bottles of hot scarab, uh, uh -huh. gold scarab, are weighing him down. Um, okay. He's, he's going to, to doggy paddle towards the ground. <laughs> and uh, uh, allow Ham to to descend. Um, he doesn't quite figure out how to to touch the ground himself, so he's just sort of nope, still hovering. Yep. Uh, doing cartwheels in the air. And uh, <laughs> would you would you classify this the snail as an animal or a beast? Uh, as neither. That should give you a big hint. Well, I just tricked you into into giving me information that was relevant for my spell. Uh, mm -hmm. Guys, don't matter again. Well, I, I, I mean, it is setting everything on fire, and I'm pretty sure snails don't do that when they're normal beasts. We are in a fantasy world. You are in a fantasy world, but you know. The and my character between... is incredibly stupid. Yes, your character is an idiot. <laughs> I forgot. I'm so sorry. Yes, carry on. As am I. Uh, he <laughs> he doesn't have any ranged weaponry. He is going to throw one of the bottles. Uh, how potent is that alcohol, by the way, when he when he drank the entire bottle? Well, you're you're floating, honey. Well, so that's true. You tell me. He's just gonna <laughs> throw it at the at the snail. Okay, roll a uh, improvised weapon. Sure. So just dex then, right? Mm-hmm. And that is going to hit it. So what's going to happen is the uh, alcohol is going to... Oh, I'm looking at the wrong monster. <laughs> uh, it's still going to hit it anyway. <laughs> the uh, um, alcohol is going to hit the snail. It's quite big, so it's really hard to miss. Um, and then it's going to... Uh, you know, like, it, imagine it, this thing is like the size of a, a fishing boat, for example. So it's going to hit the hull, so to speak, on the side. And, they um, and it's all sticky and snail juicy and stuff. So... The alcohol is going to uh, pour over it, and then it's instantly going to set it on fire, which does nothing. Uh, Beans doesn't think so. He's he's actually convinced he's just killed it. Yeah. I did it, everyone. Yay! And that's my turn. Uh, yeah. Okay, well done. Nice one. Uh, let's go for the next person. Is the oh, I've lost my turn. I is is the snail but it's too far away to do anything so it's just going to sit there and set things on fire hold on a second hold on a second i'm holding on yeah no it, it can't do anything <laughs> it's just going to oh no it's going to sense that someone threw something at it and it's going to curl up into its shell it is afraid of me it it's is afraid dead. of you <laughs> yes if anyone has sword, throw it now. 
Right, let's go to... I've got so many tabs open that I can't find the one I need. Boris. 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 I am Boris. <laughs> I'm invincible. It's true voice. I'm invincible. <laughs> Boris. Boris. Okay, I will go 5, 10, 15, 20... Five. I just saw what you yeah. wrote. Look, look, too hot and slimy. <laughs> and then Not I'm going to <laughs> take out my holy symbol and use my channel divinity, arcane abjuration. That was a lot of words that I barely understood. Okay. okay. If it is a celestial, elemental, or fey, or fiend... Um, it's got to make a wisdom saving throw. Okay. Uh, let's have a look. Mm, it got a five. Okay, so it failed. And it is now turned for one minute. So it's scared. It's Yeah, scared. But it's turn undead, but for elementals. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, at the moment, it's like huddle up in its shell so it can't move anyway so okay great but it so won't get any over? closer it won't gosh, no it won't I, I then will end my turn look guys it, it's okay it's not dead though it's going to go over there or further away we can get down these set of stairs but we're going to struggle getting past the bush Balgraf <laughs> so it's your question, turn is there a drop I take it though it's because of the stairs but what is the drop Sort of yeah, we established it was like five feet, and we had the argument that like fifteen meters or something. I can't remember. It's it's so five like twenty feet. foot set of stairs is just like overkill. It's just a ramp the... going up. Yeah, it's just a ramp going up. Like it starts like okay. from twenty feet. Okay. So what would the the movement difference be in going down? Just add an extra five foot. Hmm. Okay. I think no, those ramps are for these new wheeled chairs. Do they call them? Right. Right, I've got this. I'll uh, click my oh, hang on, my my heels together. You know, in a whole like Wizard of Oz style, because who doesn't click their heels together in a Wizard of Oz style? And all of a sudden, I shall bonus action dash using the feature I just posted in the chat and run my way forty-five feet over here. To the thing that's on fire. To the thing the that's on fire. Because I've got this. Nice. And then I shall whip out my main hammer and take a swing with it. <laughs> you have to say it like that. <laughs> <laughs> what? I have, I have a main hammer We're and children. an offhand We're children. hammer. So I must <laughs> hit it with my main hammer. At least I don't have a sword. Just say. Oh, yeah. Okay, go on. Uh, oh, just smack it in the face, but in the, in the shell. You're gonna miss. <laughs> no, it misses. What? This thing can barely move, and it misses. Damn it. Yeah, yeah. You're... Well, it's got a really thick shell, so it just imagine okay. the hammer is not really doing anything. So it's just like boing, uh. boing. It hasn't taken any damage, so technically the the, yes. the turn doesn't. Doesn't, yes. um, so, uh, I, like, uh, I, I missed, and that, that's me done. <laughs> you don't have your offhand. Uh, I bonus the expedition oh, retreat is a bonus action. action. Okay. For me to then um, be able to dash. <clears throat> all right, all right, all right. I will. I would say I'd I'd look at this thing and say, okay, so it looks like that snail is pretty much one of those fire snails or whatever, and we want to set this place alight. And uh, why don't we all get out of here um, and just go away someplace else? I mean, uh, uh, you know, um, sh I mean, shall we do that instead? Let's eat the snail. Let's eat the snail. Are you spending your turn persuading them? Because that sounds like an action. I, I, I am per I'm persuading them. Because I, I am persuading them because I thought they wanted to burn this place down. Right. And then persuade, there's convenient persuade snail party. here. Persuade okay. your party. Persuade your party. Please. 
I'm going to have a baby in a minute. Like a, not like on screen, but bring the baby down. Never mind. <laughs> that one. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm pretty much stumbling over my own words. I mean, uh, f f fight, fight, snap, get, get up. Let, let's go. Let's go. Eat let's... the snail. Eat the snail. Eat... Beads <laughs> wanted to leave. Eat the snail. <laughs> Beads wanted to leave, but now you've convinced him to stay. <laughs> oh, man. What is this place? I mean, it's just like... I've got my hammers. I can tenderize it for us. <laughs> yes, everyone. Uh... <laughs> This place is so weird. Oh, I used to have we everything. Don't it it to we don't even need the oven. <laughs> I remember days when everybody did things for me, but okay. Okay. Right, it's Ham's turn. Uh, ham. ham is going to charge path. Oh no, she can't reach. Oh, okay. She's gonna she's gonna run to the edge. Uh get tuckered out, have us pause, a little breather. <laughs> Uh, she'll then, she'll then get out her beloved stick because she's so smart. Oh dear! She's gonna throw the stick at the enemy. <laughs> I love her. I love her. Um, I love should her I be rolling my staff or should I be rolling something else? <laughs> um, do you want know to just, just may as well just use the staff stats? Okay. Why not? This, this is to hit. Oh, that is not to hit. That is my hand. <laughs> main stick. Uh, <laughs> that is your yeah, main stick. stick. Sorry, um, <laughs> did I do it this? Oh my! No, no, right, that, is still mine stick. no that is still my stick. <laughs> you need to let go when you throw it. It's stuck. <laughs> it's so stuck. I told you to wash you your hands. Manu I'll manually roll it. <laughs> yeah, when you wash your hands, remember to sing Happy Birthday. Uh, let's not let's not do that. <laughs> Don't do that, Lee. Huh? Nineteen. Oh, oh nineteen does hit. Wow. Right. Then let's see if. Uh... I have a baby again. Oh, sorry, baby. Getting a birth again. Why? Why didn't you? Why didn't you roll on the thing? Why are you? <laughs> <laughs> We're waiting for the question. It's That's quite working. good damage, though. Is it working? No, I can see it in the... And... You've done it twice! Oh, sorry, ignore the second one because it's not loading up for me. <laughs> well, I'm not seeing anything. I'm seeing the 1d20. Wait, what are we looking at? I see 1d20 <laughs> plus 3. Is that it? The first one was a 7, the second one was a 2. Yeah, They're coming up yeah. in D&D &D Beyond. Ah, there we go. Okay, <laughs> you see it on there. There we go. So you saw the 7. <sighs> right. Oh, 7 damage. Oh. I didn't. I don't see anything. But we'll just yeah. So Jason seven damage. Didn't learn. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, what wonderful. So take seven damage. Wow, guys, you are absolutely doing nothing to this thing. But it's no longer turn now. Um, My stick. Your stick. <laughs> your stick is um, burning. The no, creature is going to peek its slimy snail head out from its shell. It's like monster. And hunter. it's going to let out its screech. Oh, that's too cute. Okay. Anyway, um, oh, yeah, please <laughs> protect. <laughs> that's okay. the most tiny three. Flambe snail. Yes, I'm going to thumbs up that. <laughs> Ooh, maybe we should get the chat to roll the next d20. Who in the chat would like to roll a d20? Let's get Lil Lilabazo to roll a d20 oh, in the chat. Come on, Buzz. Roll us 20. Couldn't they do if you roll something bad, rolls? I swear to God. That <laughs> will be <Yeah>. you. <laughs> Hang on. How do I roll? That is a good That's question. That's what I was about to ask. Yeah, one <laughs> second. A robot. There's a robot in there, isn't there? Oh, right. is no, there? there's no. not. Oh, isn't there? Hang on. Sorry. Best. Yeah, it, this is the on demand. <laughs> me making a command. This idiot. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> I'm sorry to put you on the spot because clearly I don't understand how streaming works. Roll the real dice and lie. Yes, I like this. <laughs> yeah, that was the <laughs> other <good> thing. One. <laughs> yes. You could, roll, you could roll a real dice. I will take it. Let me get my dice. Let oh, me come get on, my dice. <laughs> we, we trust you. <laughs> it's a one. I won't hurt you tomorrow. I promise. <laughs> Not too bad, anyways. They are actually getting their dice because otherwise they would have lied already, right? Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> I trust that. Here we go. Here we, Here we go. go. Here we go. They're going to get a drum roll. So, many, <laughs> so funny fact. I rolled a one. <laughs> oh, of course yeah. you did. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Amazing. Okay, well, Very what's going nice. <laughs> to We're going to take that one. No, yeah, no, no. Take, we'll take that one. I'll tell you what's going to happen. Uh, Bren, it's your uh, sorry, not Bren. Ha uh, Beans, it's your turn and then it's going to be the creature's turn and I'll tell you what we'll do. Here. Beans is uh, going to fly into into the hacienda again and he's going to look around if he can find any salt. Oh. Oh, sorry, I was looking at a chat. That's that's all right. You're you're just the game master. <laughs> it's not like <laughs> I'll just make my own game. Uh, he finds. <laughs> so sorry, I was reading what. No, anyway, can you please explain again? I apologize. So my character, <laughs> Beans, uh, flies into the hacienda <laughs> and right, he, he looks around for salt, like a big a big bag of salt. Salt! Oh, okay. All right. So, uh, I mean, there's like the open sacks. One of them happens to be a giant sack of salt that's spilling out. I like that I only have to annoy you enough to give me what I want. <laughs> uh, he's They're going, open, so. Yeah, he's going to shovel as much of it into his pockets as he can and then and fly his out. And... The beers in them. Well, he started drinking them to, to light himself. So he's got like one pocket that's empty. Yeah. Okay. So what I don't know how many pockets he has, but I've, from my description, I think he, his his outfit is just pockets. All right. Okay. So he's going to fill. Let's say roll a d10, and then that's how many pockets of salt you have. But that's going to be your whole turn. I'm sorry. Fine. I've got two pockets of salt. You've got two pockets of salt. That weighs yes. about half a pound between them. He's right. not so much flying anymore as just scraping along the ground. Okay. Right, let's go uh, with <clears throat> next person, who is the snail. So the snail is going to pop its head out, and then it is going to... Um, it, it almost looks like it's smiling at you, Balgraf. Oh. Yeah, except it's not. It's going to try and, and kill you. So it's going to hit you with its flail, its, its tentacly things that are coming out of its head. You know, like the... Uh, you know, the antenna thingy this, that goes down and up. The I eye stalks? The eye stalks, <laughs> that's the one. It's going to mm -hmm. attack you with those. Go. Ah, 23 to hit. Does it hit you? Mm. Balgraf, does it hit you with 23? Yes, it does. Float? It does. Okay, sorry, you're doing yes. the, the thing. Okay, yes, so I was take, uh, correcting my bad grammar. Nine, you're t going to take nine bludgeoning damage. Nine bludgeoning damage. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. Just what I always wanted. Of course. Let me just update my health bar, which is somewhat hidden by a giant snail. Sorry. Um <laughs> And then what's going to happen is that as you are all fighting it, and this is thanks to the num the one that uh, your friend Lil Baz. Lil, Lil Bazo Baz, Baz what Baz yes Baz, Baz. 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 okay sorry uh, rolled a a hole is going to open up in the ground the earth is literally going to open up. And the creature is going to half fall into it. So only the top half of the creature is going to be there. And it's almost upside down because the the back the, the weight of the uh, carapace is going to be weighing it backwards. And now it's full on stuck and it's like wriggling around with its eyes poking in and out. Um, and that's going to be its turn over. So thank you, Baz, for making sure the party doesn't die. It's now. Uh, Yay! <laughs> yeah. I'm going to draw the portal underneath it. So, so it's gone. Sorry, I was distracted by creating a command. No, no, no! It's still there. It's still, <laughs> oh. no, no, it's, it's still there. It's still there. Is it? Is it? Is it like no. prone on the floor? But yes. Up, 
So well, that means we get automatic crits, I guess. Get... No, you get advantage. Oh, all right. Oh, yes. Right. It's like, mo it's like Monster Hunter, isn't it? has his hammers at the ready <laughs> when it, he gets this way. Been playing Rise lately. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, it's going to be uh, Boris's turn next. Okay. Oh, look at the poor little thing that's now I know. prone. <laughs> I know. Oh my gosh, that doesn't show up at all. <laughs> what doesn't? The portal I'm trying to draw now. Yes, it does. Remember. It's okay, underneath we the. Can see it. I can see a, okay, yeah, good, I see good, a black good, rectangle good, good. underneath the oh, snow. Nice. Okay. Anyway, okay, I'm going to. Boris. I'm going to shoot it with a ray of frost, and since it's prone, it'd be at disadvantage and miss completely. And then I'm going to walk down the stairs casually. Actually, <laughs> and then I will end my turn. <laughs> oh, I like how the the portal's got purple bits around it now. Well, I didn't draw that. That's because I can't draw. Um, oh. I think that was only <laughs> Ham. Or was it Bren? Who was it? Was it wasn't. Honestly, me. a mystery. A mystery. <laughs> a mystery. Right. Uh, it is Algraf's turn. Ah. Well. Now I have one hammer in my hand, I shall also pull out the other. And then I shall swing with my mighty hammers. And if it's out of its shell, aim for where its face should be. If it's in shell, aim for that. Crack that thing it's open like a shell. nut. It's out of the shell. Oh, the shell is it, peeking out, and then it's falling Let's back. Let's tenderize forward. some meat. Uh, Yum! And it's prone, so I get advantage on both swings. Yeah. It's you, indeed. Things. Smash! Things. There's 20 hits. Yes. Oh. oh! How much damage Let's, does it do? I don't know. When the button actually works, I will let you know. Well, hey! Well, hey! Well, hi! But, Just for some reason, the, <laughs> the button is not working. You're going to have to <laughs> roll it down. Yeah, the same issue is wider. <laughs> the DB on add-on sometimes doesn't work, everyone. But we still love it. Yes, I remember that. Uh, 1D4. Plus two. Your hammer's only on 1d4. Nice. Whoa. Yes, it is because it's a light yeah. hammer, so I can hold it in one hand. It's also got the uh -huh. throne thing, which Guys, will come in handy at a later date. Uh, and then I shall use my bonus action to swing with my other hammer. Do it. Does a 15 hit? Does it hit? It, it doesn't. doesn't. Oh, it doesn't. Did you roll with advantage? Yeah. Yeah, yes, it yes, I did. No, no, oh, oh. no, it's going to go straight onto the. You're just going to swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. Um, let's see. I need someone else in the chat to roll a d20. Shall we ask Zeta Hawk? Zeta roll me a d20. Go, Zeta. You can use the command it now. It works. We promise. It does. And it's grammatically correct because I correct you where go. I put roll to Zeta. roll. I had a hammer. I'd hammer in the morning and I'd hammer in the evening. Oh. What did... They were on a 10! Oh! oh. Right. <laughs> what are they going to do? Who's next on the... That What's going to happen is um, it's going to start... That rain that we were talking about oh, is going to get worse. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, then you're going to have this weird feeling as you look at the creature still setting everything on fire by the way um yeah. you know exactly how to bring it down because you fought this thing before i Ooh. fought i fought well, this thing you? you just think it you have and you know that actually trying to aim for the shell is the way to get rid of this thing because if you can crack the shell open you basically kill it Oh, okay. All right. But the shell oh. has a, a a plus four in AC, so just so you know, it's gonna be harder to hit. <laughs> oh, all right. I, I I I will try to do that. Um, Thank you, um, Hawk. Don't you get that fe this feeling of deja vu? Total snail. Uh, so basically, um, as it's my go, uh, Bren is going to move like about he's going to move uh, thirty feet, and he's going to go. Come on, Bren, you could do this, and then he's going to second wind. Um, so. 
so he's going to kind of like get like oh that only ex okay that only explains the thing not rolls it okay one d ten plus on health you can't gain health two I can what you are sick oh, you are sick oh, yeah. you can't oh. gain health but so, if I recall correctly second wind no no it's not temporary hit points is it yeah no you can't gain I'm sorry it doesn't work. <laughs> Okay, okay. So he's he's going to use it. Go, come on, <coughs> and then and then after, after so oh. instead instead of that, he um no instead of that because he's just used it, he's going to use um actions. He's going to use action surge to get like a bit of bit more energy, so he can actually get near the thing, mm -hmm. uh, near the thing's shell. So he's going to take like a twenty five feet of movement to get here, and he's going to attack the shell with all his might. With his great sword. Okay, I'll let that happen. Yeah, I uh, actually. Uh, smack it, smack it, smack it, smack, smack it. it with a hammer. Great or sword. a sword. One of those. Ah! You do it with Ooh! a bandage. 22. <laughs> 13 oh. slash and damage. Okay, I'm going to have to get a calculator out, guys, because I didn't have to do math in my head anymore. So I was here. I went. Oh, 30 hello. here. Who in the chat hasn't rolled a d20 yet? No, no one. Who do we have in the chat left? Who else is watching? I'm going to get Float to roll one. Speak now or never roll the dice. Yes. Oh, no, we'll let, we'll let Baz we'll do it again. Oh, that's <laughs> Not <fine>. you. Not <laughs> Float. Not you. <laughs> you may as well No, 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 it's fine. What else? Let, let one of the actual <laughs> people who isn't in the stream roll it. <laughs> so at least then we can blame them and not me. <laughs> I can see that another person has come in, but I can't see what the like. I can't see the names. Hey, they might be disjointed. Fine. They might be shy. It's okay. Yeah, okay, that's yes. true. Right, float. Can you please put your role in the you, chat? You actually want me to put the role in the chat? Okay. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I do. Yes, I do. That's a crit on my damage. A fifteen. Fifteen. Ooh. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Very nice. Thank you. All right. Thank okay. You fifteen. Point. Right, so first of all, I'm still trying to figure out how much damage you've done to this thing, by the way. <laughs> because I don't know what math, I don't know how numbers work. So you crit. No, you didn't crit. Okay. Uh, all right, so um, what's going to happen is the creature is going to let out another piercing screech as the there is a hole made in, the, uh, in its carapace. And the rain is pouring into that hole. And it's it's like it's you can see it's like writhing and smoking as that happens as if the rain was actually putting something out and um and then you're gonna see kind of it's like lifeblood i suppose oozing out of out of it as well out of the carapace as well and that is like... friend's turn over um, next person. All right, I think it's dying. I think it's dying. Um, it's it's Ham. Yeah. Who's that? Ham. Um, okay, so Ham realizing <laughs> the stick is is where is the stick? Do we have a location? Oh, no. no. Sorry. Ham's gonna leap over to the snail. Uh, I'm guessing that's gonna be in acrobatics again. From this this point? Yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> Boom. She leaps over, lands on the shell, is looking for the stick, cannot find the stick, is very upset by this, is also getting very angry, but mostly upset, and through her tears, she withdraws her claws and aims for the eyes. Oh, the tentacly eyes! Oh, I clicked it twice. It's, ignore it's, the ignore the second one. Look I got a crit on the first one. one. Yay. 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 <laughs> How was the damage? Uh, we're about to see. Six hole damage. Wow. You should have cried into the hole. <laughs> you destroyed my stick. <laughs> <laughs> and she'll grapple onto the other air. <laughs> and uh, that will be my turn. Why is this cut on me? <laughs> Back um, to the top of the round. Uh, but before that, I need Baz to do me a d20 roll. Damn it. Give her something good. 
Go on, Vag, you got this. Excellent. Roll us that nat 20. Uh, eight. eight. Let's see, here comes. Here it comes. Oh, it's like, oh. And An eight. Oh, eight. Everyone's going to need to make a deck save. What? Whoa. Oh, no. You're going to have to uh, make a deck save as uh, you hear the skies got... rumbling. Did I, I and don't like deck saves. And wind is going to come oh, across no. the entire what? area. The people behind you who are screaming and running around, oh, most gosh. of them are going to get knocked over. <laughs> if you got below a 12, you are going to be flat on your backside oh. because oh. the wind has knocked you back onto your bum. Oh. <laughs> and you're going to take... <laughs> I, I, I got flattened as well. I don't know why um, um, Ham is on top of me, but wow, Ham that's is an awkward position. Ham is, Ham is on top of the, the snail's the head. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a very strong argument. Uh, the the snail should t- take some bludgeoning damage from uh, Ham falling oh. down on top of her. I'd say about two d twelve. Yes. I'm pretty heavy. Yeah. Does the snail get pushed over? The snail is stuck in a hole with this giant. It's like it's giant. It's stuck in a hole, right? And it can't do anything. It's screaming. Also, it's snail. Like, oh, it's Am is uh, clinging onto its eye right now. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do one d4 slashing damage for it. Aye. One whole extra damage. Good job. Okay, bright. It is Beans' turn. Go um, on. Oh, beans with with two pockets full of. Of cells, cells, cells. <laughs> cells. He's going to uh, uh, double move out here, witnessing the chaos. Witnessing the chaos, <laughs> and uh, that's sadly all he can do right now. <laughs> Fifty feet. You throw more alcohol at it, see what happens. No, I can't. I, I don't have any option. Uh, any any extra Oh, you got the salt. Can't you just throw the salt and hope for the best? It was it this kind of wind. <laughs> yeah, you never know. You can throw it like. Just, just to be fair, not let anyone calls me out. I just double moved. If you're giving me a free action to to throw salt, I'm more than happy to. All right. What does the chat think? Do we get? Do we let Beans do a double action just for just for? Because let- Maz wants the combo to be over. <laughs> no, I'm trying to do like your participation here. It's a tactic or something. No, he doesn't have action he, surge. He, he doesn't have an action surge. I'm a bard. I'm getting okay. I'm getting the extra feet action surge. Uh, <laughs> in the chat. Well, no one in the chat saying anything. <laughs> I'm guessing they don't care about your character. They don't. They, they just want us all to die. That's what it is. It's <laughs> secret. Yeah. Well, not so secret. Right. Just... The council has spoken. What does the council say? Has spoken. Who's who's spoken? Spoken. Council has spoken. I'm pretty spooked right now. Oh, and we'll up. let you. Oh, yes. Yeah, okay. Yes, extra action. The extra action goes. Yeah. 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 He throws a handful of salt at the yeah. At the <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay. So let's do your roll attack roll. It's a twenty-three. Uh, it's going to hit it. Ooh. Do you want to do your acid damage? Do one d six. Nice. Nice. Ah! Six. Oh! Oh! Everyone's getting like really like when you guys ha- are on like one B twelves for real for damage. You're only going to get like twos and threes yep. because yep. you're using up all your maxes here. Quick, hit it with the cured ham. There should be salt on it. <laughs> no, um, not the ham. No, 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 no. <laughs> The hell forever. Um, it's now this creature's turn, and it's going to attack. Ham, cry on oh, it. Yeah. Uh, no, this is what it's going to do. Grab the salt and rub it in. Can everyone make a wisdom saving throw, please? Oh no! I'm yes. It's going no. to. I can definitely <laughs> give it a shot. No. Eleven. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> All right. No one's going to like what happens. Um, ooh, oh. Only Beans and Balgraf save. Basically, the creature with its broken and busted shell is going to... You're going to hear some a sound ah! its body is making. And <laughs> that sound. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. It's making these sounds. 
and it's going to glow so bright, almost yeah. as bright as the sun itself. And anyone who got a below a 14 is going to yeah. fail the save. Yeah. And you are going to be blinded and stunned yeah. until the light finishes. So that's not going to affect Beans and it's not going to affect Balgroff because you two do save, but you do have disadvantage on attack against the <laughs> which means you just right. get like normal rolls. Right, we have a break even. Someone yes, thought, I'm putting wisdom points into my character. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> this guy did. This guy, you are your this guy has very low stats, <laughs> by the way. Just... Just, oh, I don't know. I feel like this party isn't very well thought of, for thought out, but anyway. Um, it's what happens when you get random stats. Yeah, yeah so I'm, I'm afraid, Boris, you're going to have to take your turn. Oh, my God, my eyes. As, as blinded, but you can, at the end of your... I'm blinded and stunned. You're literally just, you're just blinded. You're just no. You're literally stunned, not blinded. Sorry, just stunned. But still, it's oh, oh, I can open my eyes. <laughs> you're in the you can't move. You can be like, oh, bleh, 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 bleh. Uh, uh, no, no, no. Bleh, 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 bleh. Right, that's your turn over. Sorry, you don't even get saved. It's Balgraf's turn next. No. Bah, bah, Wait, bah, he doesn't bah, get bah, a bah, bah, turn. Bah, bah, bah. Oh, because he's stunned. Oh, oh Balgraf. Yeah. You, yes, you, yes. Yeah. it is me. Uh, what shall I do? What shall I do? I don't know. You see so your lost. friend stunned and blinded. What should you do? I can't, I can't unstun them or unblind them. I have nothing that can do that kind of activity. <laughs> thing that's dying and oozing its like lifeblood right in front of you. Yeah, I could do that. You Just to clarify, are, there we are go. I blind or, or not? No, you're not. You're fine. You can do things. Cool. Yeah. We now we dance. Where? I cleared it. But, uh, I shall, yes, just go, go for the smash. Smash it. Um, smash I will it try it. and smish it. Smoosh it. But you were told to hit the carapace. Smash. Just so I was told to hit the carapace. <laughs> Carapace, yes. I shall aim Carapace. for the carapace. carapace. In that case. Carapace. There's my 22 hit. <laughs> yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. It is Defo's going to hit. <laughs> then take five. And then I shall swing with mine other hammer. And yes, a 23 Ooh. hits. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys. And there's wow. another two. It is dying and bleeding all over you, but it's not dead yet. It's not oh, bleeding. Just, turn. Is the carapace at least cracked slightly from oh, this yeah, like, like, onslaught of smashes with cracked. hammers? And you can <laughs> see the core of the creature pulsating with its fiery energy, and the rain is just smashing down on it, hissing, the steam rising off its body. Beans. Uh, Beans <laughs> sees that the this creature has made his sister cry, so he's going to fly on top of its its shell and empty his uh, second salt pocket into the hole. Okay, well, uh, you can roll with advantage, even though you're blinded as well. Oh, no, you're not blinded. No, no, he's here. Yes! So it's a d6, right? Yes. Minimum damage. <laughs> minimum damage. In fact, so minimum that it, it stays alive. <laughs> it's going to, it's going to, with its dying breath, um, smack Balgraf because why not? Right. It's going to, no, it's, it's going to kill Balgraf. Single. It is going to probably not come out. Yeah, because you're going to take a uh, nat, a nat 20 in the face. Yes, oh, I'm down in that 11. case, one way. Yeah, I'm damage. Oh, oh no! Oh, it's now Balgraf is turn. now. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. now falls unconscious on the ground. Dead. Beans. Seeing that the situation is hopeless, Beans is going to leave. <laughs> <laughs> Beans. Uh, no, Beans is uh, heroically. He's going to to uh, give up on his salt tactic, considering he doesn't have any more, and he's uh, going to pull his rapier. And he's gonna stab at stab at the heart inside the shell. It's gonna hit. 
Woo. You just have to do one damage and you, you killed it. Yes. Yay. Yeah. Our friend, the, work, the, 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 thing, the thingy from under the ground or whatever is no more. You have uh, I'm going to run over to Balgraf. Yes, the light is now diminished, so you can, you're no longer uh, stunned. Okay. Uh, and to confirm Balgraf uh, then can be healed. Go. He's Put one of the few people who can. <laughs> and oh. then healing word on you. Oh, jeez. My... Oh, if so you're diseased, God. you can't be healed. Remember? He's not diseased. I'm no. not diseased. As I'm one of the no, few no, who can be. Diseased. I'm just saying to the, other, the others. Yeah. Five <laughs> healing. <laughs> I'm alive! Oh. No, 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 that, that's unrealistic. Oh, oh, that hurt. Are you oh, are you okay, fellow dwarf? I, I am. My my dwarfish constitution has kept me going. No, I that's my healing word. Oh, okay. Maybe you shouldn't run Tell straight the into the battle. Tell that it was my dwarfish constitution, if they ask, okay? <laughs> okay. But maybe when we attack things, you should be over here. Look, I was over there quite safe. Yes, but but my hammers they're, 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 they don't have quite the range of of your your like magic i, I must say eventually okay. though eventually after oh, a long rest geez. i'll work on that i'll make it so just they so can become more use at range just so you know uh it's still pouring with rain you guys are has complete. anybody got an umbrella <laughs> uh, no no, I just I I I, 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 I hold my shield up above my head. I, I mean, we could get inside. I mean, I, I feel like I'm going to get infected more. I mean, uh, it, oh god, it's, it's kind of gross standing, even standing here next to this corpse and stuff. You know, I still um, can't believe it's right? the tail. The stick, the hole ate my stick. <laughs> Why don't you go look for it? I'm sure it's not that deep. I would like to look around for a similar stick in a tree and go break it off and give it to her. Uh, yeah, okay. I'll see if you can do that. Let's uh, do a survival check, I suppose. Okay. Wait, it's a hole still there, right? No. Is it? Yeah. You I find the stick, find but it's not the same stick. It is still in the hole, but the creature is currently <laughs> filling up most of the hole. Ephibia is going to run out of the hacienda and she's going to look like a drowned rat. Uh, and her fake lashes are coming undone, and um, uh, you know her mascara is running all down her face, and she's just looking the worst for wear. And she's going to say, "Oh, oh you're all so brave. Uh, perhaps we should leave and uh, and get somewhere safer. Um, I'm sure this place can get burned down another time. We'll just block it up. Block it up, gentlemen, for now. Block it up. Just make sure no one can get in." One moment. Yes. We have exterminated yet another vermin for you. That will be another two hundred and fifty gold. Per person. If you don't give it, I'll cry more. We have a healer who will resurrect the snail if you do not pay. Deception. Oh god. You want me to? You want me to heal it? Deception. I'm gonna <laughs> give myself bardic inspiration for this. Yeah, and I get to tap you with guidance. Does this Thank land you. have like any kind of thing that can restrate my problems with this disease? <laughs> restrate your problems with what disease? You're not diseased, are you? Um, <laughs> uh, 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 by a rat. Um, <laughs> something else. Oh. Uh, 27. Wow. Unless, unless wow. Than that 20. Uh, <laughs> no. <laughs> No, he can do that. Oh no! Uh, but I don't have the authority to tell, um, to ask you for. Uh, I suppose I'll have to go and find the mayor, but he's he's so far away. Um. Okay, so yeah. healing word, yes. Z Zeta. Yes. Uh, I would like Zeta to roll a d twenty in the chat if he's watching. Zeta, can you roll a d twenty? My dear. If he's paying attention, I literally can't tell. Only problem with this. We got money. Yes. We got money. Right. Roll seven. Right. Right. The cloud cover is going to be so thick. Uh, you're going. You're not going to have noticed the fact that when they finally dissipate and the rain, it's still is still raining. By the way, uh, it's actually going to be night time. And uh, in the distance, you're going to see a whole constellation that you've never seen before appear um, above uh, the, the, the horizon. Very bright, very amazing. 
And Ophelia is going to be making her, but the mayor, he's the one who approves all payments and, and his assistants also, but they're both in the exhibition and, oh, oh, look at that. That's beautiful. Uh, money, and please. To, and, and she's going to be staring up at the, at the sky. And so are the people who are, her gentlemen, you know, people who are trying to set the place on fire, not anymore now, they're boarding up. Um, and you will do notice this, except for Beans, who's money, please. That's a very interesting set of stars up there. Do you happen to know the name of it? They're brand new, she says. Uh, Unlikely. I've never it seen reminds it me of my stick. Uh, <laughs> I don't even know what the stars are. I, found, I did find a replacement stick and I hold the stick I found up. It's not you the same. found it! You found it! Okay, never mind. <laughs> go and grab it. <laughs> Here you go. Oh, oh, thank you. Uh, you're all going to hear a really loud rumbling emanating from the area uh, under this new constellation that's appeared. And uh, that whole region, just beyond the, the tree line, you're going to see it light up um really bright and it's going to look like a sun as if the sun was coming from that direction <sighs> and uh, and then everything is going to go back to the daytime because it's still only about through three or four in the afternoon oh. and it's still going to be raining and you still hear the guys going ah this bloody rain blah, blah, blah. <laughs> maybe that's maybe that over there was maybe maybe the place of the you know the whole weather spikes and stuff like that um then again, uh, but does anybody have an antidote? Uh, no, no, sorry, I don't. Oh, um, but you said you weren't bitten. Were you? I no, he wasn't bitten. It's, I it's, told uh, you. But if he's poisoned, he's not diseased. She's not all right. Um, uh, an antidote is for poison. All right. But, um, it's, okay. Is there any? I'm gonna. Is there any? Um, do you, does anybody have like any? Because I'm, I'm pretty much trained in like um, al uh, like alchemy and herbalism. Maybe I can like a. Uh, see if there's any kind of utensils that I can use for kind of making a, an antidote, uh, an antidote for myself. Old. Okay, I'd like um, I'd like you to make a constitution save, um, Bren. Okay, constitution save. Come on. You need to please. Get above 12. Please. Yeah! Ooh, nice. Okay, so you're going to feel the bites sting you so much and it's going to make <laughs> wow. you wince but nothing else is going to happen. But you know, you know, you can feel that uh, those bites are getting super infected. Oh, for God Christ. I and mean... that's where we're going to finish the session. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, man. <laughs> wow, nice. guys, can you believe it? We got a whole, like, 60 feet outside of this place we were at the start of the two-hour session. <laughs> <laughs> we went so far. Right, Toby. I feel <laughs> like there's something out. important that needs saying. Maybe. Yeah, same. Maybe the treasure was last time. I just wanted to say, maybe the real treasure is the snails we kill along the way. <laughs> the escargot. The escargot that you're now going to feast upon. Great. So thank you for watching, everyone. And we will catch you again in two weeks. Um, if you are interested in playing with the Tabletop Tavern, please do visit our website at tabletoptavern.club. And, um, yes. See you next. Bye. See you in See you in the second week. To, never mind. Bye. Thank you. Bye. For see you Bye. 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 See you in the second week. <laughs> see you in two.